Jose, and welcome back to Grow with the Jan Family. I'm Anjali. And today we're going to be doing a different video, political video, but we kind of found it after watching some of these other videos we've done. Mm -hmm. You know, we did the Pakistani kids talking about how they would kind of talking like jihad and um, and then India's children's response of how they've grown up learning that, you know, if you're a guest in their house, they will feed you and treat you like a god, like, a god. like such a different message. Um, and it was definitely political and it was definitely, you know, meant just, you know, for propaganda, but horrible propaganda. And, you know, we've done these congressional hearings recently and it seems like, um, you know, India's voice has not been loud enough. Yeah. And, um, you know, this, we are trying to teach peace on our channel and love and, you know, the videos we've seen from Imran Khan and from some of these other leaders have been hateful against India. Yeah. And when the leaders do it, then you get these pop stars that are putting on a bomb vest and going to blow up. Prime Minister Modi and, then and you get kids who are watching then the pop you get stars. kids who are saying they're going to you know eat beef in front of everybody in India or yeah. make them scrub the toilets like it starts from somewhere and it trickles down and it just gets bigger and bigger and then it cycles again and so this is like a video compilation of how does this start like where does it start where does it come from why and who is the winner in the end? Like, who yeah. is going to win with all this hate? Hate only brings more hate. Darkness only brings more darkness. So you need love and light. And hopefully we can shed some light on this video. Yep. And um, hopefully we can spread some peace and love in the end. So let's start it up, Anji. Can the state survive sponsoring care? No. Pakistan Minister Ali own words. Robbie Brzada posted pictures of a suicide mass threatening in this prime minister. Modi. This is what I like. You're reinforcing the image of terrorist Muslims, which the West and India accused Pakistan of. I'm glad people were turning her back. Yeah. Pakistan kids. This was the opportunity. Indian Army ko hum galiyan saaf karne mein laga denge, aur main abu se kahungi ki Goa ke sahil pa ek bada ta karte hain. Mujhe Hindi zaman likhni nahi aati. Ab sirf Urdu chalegi ha. Kitna maza aayega jab hum Delhi gate par gaye ke kebab khayenge. ताजमहल पर जश्न तकमीले पाकिस्तान मनाएंगे फतेह के बाद 2020 की छुट्टियों में मैं शिमला जाऊंगी हम जब आएंगे ना तो पूरे मुल्क में बासुर मना के देंगे सुन लो आरएसएस के दहशतगर्दों अब हर मुसलमान की शहादत का बदला लेंगे क्योंकि अब हिंद बनेगा पाकिस्तान And then kids are like, oh, this is okay. Yeah, who is Not responsible right. for the leadership? Leadership does matter. You know, that's how the hatred comes. And this is what is floor. going to happen you know, when the curfew is lifted will be a bloodbath. Yeah. I'm in Kashmir. Would I, would I want to live this humiliation? No. Would I want to live like that? I would pick up a gun. Uh, oh my God, again? Nobody's going to pick up a gun. So this is the vicious cycle, you know, it starts from leaders, Imran Khan, and then leaders, and then you know, pop stars, and then kids, like kids yeah. watch these pop stars. Yeah, well it comes, you know, it tears down, it yeah. goes in the cycle, and it, it needs to be stopped. <sighs> it's a petting, Pakistan is a petting zoo for terrorists, Christine Fair said, India's international community. Samoon Malan was caught in Pakistan. We hope and pray for peace as it can do wonders for people in Pakistan and everywhere else in the world, especially for India. They share a lot in common. Can 
the site will be stopped. Well, Imran Khan and Pakistan military and and prime ministers and minister people need to speak up. speak up and speak positively. Speak peace. Yeah. And the majority Muslims need to speak out against the hate and the terror, too. Not speak with the terror. Yeah. Just because other people are doing it doesn't mean you can... Right. And, you know, we we watched that other um, Bridget. She talked about, you know, the peaceful Muslims is the majority. Yeah. Is the majority. So where... Where are they? Are they when... But this is the problem with the cycle of hate. Like, the big people are are taking this and, you know, feeding the little people. Mm-hmm. So it's going down the tier, you know. Imran Khan is speaking bloodbath and picking up guns. And, and then a prime minister. And then a and the minister. minister is talking about any other country that supports India is going to get a missile I'll hit at them. And then a pop star is wearing a bomber vest. Bomber vest. And then Suicide kids are vest. talking about... India's cleaning toilets. Yeah, and taking over India. And, like, you know, you see how the tear goes. Yeah. And and it trickles down from the top up. And the problem with that is then you have a lot of children who eventually are going to grow up into these pop stars that are going to want to put on suicide masks. So it'll be more hate. Exactly. So hate only brings more hate. So love and peace is the only thing that's going to counter the hate. Yeah. Spreading the message, the peaceful Muslims, the Muslim majority that is not doing jihad, that is not doing terrorism, you need to speak out against this. Speak up. And Tell it to the media. spread the word of peace and love to your brothers across the country, across the world. You are the ones that can sh- help change this. Imran Khan needs to change his his idea i mean he had the whole time to be on the floor at the un and and all he he did was spread hate the first thing he said was we planted what was it trees it was a lot of trees trees. it was a lot of trees he could have went off of that but no he went off of hate yeah picking up guns like it'll be a bloodbath if you live the curfew yeah it's just unbelievable and and but if the peaceful muslims join together and speak out against this and you it will change you know if the majority speaks out against the hate and wants the good you know light can only you know darkness can only bring more darkness yeah light can overcome the darkness peace can and love can overcome hatred all the time Mm -hmm. and hatred only brings more hate and violence and death like, that's not going to bring good things for the country, for the economy, for the world. That is not how you want your children to come. You want your children to be good people. Yeah. Everywhere in the world. Like, you want them to do good. So, hopefully, part of our message, hopefully this cycle will help bring the end of the hate cycle. We bring need to more start peace. bringing more peace sharing the love with each other sharing with the media yes and and talking out against there's a quote against the uh rabbi perzada you know this is you are showing people this is how the muslims are and that's not how they are no it's the terrorist it's i you know it's there are a group of extremists there are extremists everywhere you know they're here in the U.S. They're all over the world. But we are trying. Modi talked about it. Trump talked about it. Getting rid of the terror. Getting rid of the terrorists. And bringing peace and love into the world. And this is what we want. Yeah. So hopefully somehow sharing these messages will get rid of some of the hate. And spread the peace love. Peaceful majority. Yes. Spread the peace. So I hope you like this video. And don't forget to click that subscribe button down below. Enjoy our wonderful family, and we'll see you tomorrow. Bye. Bye.